Faster, 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 faster! Are you sad it's dead? You said I didn't see it. <laughs> All right, so a little rundown. Obviously, you saw from the last video, Micah failed the uh, pool jump. And this smart car is completely locked up now. Key won't even turn. I'm sure the electronics are absolutely fucked. We'll just probably have to yank it with the Duramax. Everyone who drives by has just been like stopping like, what, is that one of their smart cars in the pool? <laughs> you must think we just are always around over here. But I guess we kind of are, but. Yo, I don't know what happened in like the last two weeks, but I feel like we have so many video ideas and just content that is just waiting to be filmed. Like we probably have content for the next like two or three months and they're all bangers. So if you guys have not hit that subscribe button, it means the world to us. Leave a comment, drop a like. You're good, you're good right here. <laughs> I knew it was gonna be easy. It's a Duramax. It's not like a V6 Raptor or nothing. All right, so Ryan and I just picked up a whole bunch of wood. Basically, in order for us to do this easy smart car and load, we're gonna have to build a platform up over the wheel wells just because we're gonna need every single inch that we can get to squeeze this smart car in the back of the truck. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be pretty basic though, I think. Well, the boys in G-Reg just finished up the box for the back of the truck. Painted black for aesthetic reasons. Should hold the smart car, no problem. I mean, there's not a lot of reinforcement in there, but they don't weigh much. So we'll see you guys tomorrow when we easy smart car unload this thing. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? There's a number of things to go wrong. That's what we're aiming for, though, Ken. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Ken, when you spent two weeks of your life wrapping this smart car to make it look good, did you think this is yeah. how the end of its life would go? Not exactly like this, but I just wasn't quite expecting it to be this soon. Oh my gosh, this is sketchy. Yep, straight down. All right, we got her in. Talk about a tight fit. All right, so we've done a couple easy quad unloads before. Oh! Whoa! We've never done it with a smart car. Obviously, this smart car is a perfect candidate now that it's been totaled from water damage. So Ken, he's gonna be our, our stunt driver today. Stunt. It is my car. I gotta I gotta do the yeah, last little. Alright, Ken, whatever you do, just press the gas really hard and press the brake even harder. Floor it! Yeah, floor it. Floor it! Wait, so you're not riding in it? No. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you are riding in Cody, we still have time. No, where's the other Cody at? <laughs> he'll, he'll probably jump in. Yeah, he'll jump in it. Can you imagine? No, no, no. Full speed! Oh my gosh! Oh, holy shit! First ever easy unload gone right. Wait, how did this happen? Oh, what the no way! How light that car was, I still felt it hit the ground. It was <laughs> boom. Hence why the rim literally exploded. exploded. Do you guys think this tree's dead? Probably now. It might be after this. It might have to be our new Christmas tree this year. Oh my. Is that the same tree that you hit with the dirt bike guy? Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. my Why god. Why do you think I yeah, went for that one? Oh, and you were not going for that oh, one. You just got lucky. So I hard. I believe that worked as well as it did. Yo, look at where the car is right now, and then look at where he left off. Well, should we do it off the cliff? I'd say yeah, so. Yeah, might might as well. Well. It was impressive, but slightly disappointing. So the idea on this one is Ken's gonna come to about here, and then uh, the smart car is going down there. Do, it, do his best. In the theory, car. yeah. Hopefully it stops before uh, he sends the truck off the edge too. All right, Ken, this is gonna be your marker, okay? Well, uh, yeah. It depends where we put it. At least right here, huh? Bro, he's gonna slide right off. Let's at least move it I up think to if like he does right. Slide off, it's okay. There. You're have off. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That it'll be fine there. Holy <laughs> 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 shit! Full on Tony Hawk just dropped in. Yeah. <laughs> Man, this smart guy does not want to die. No, we gotta stop so that it flies off the cliff. Yeah. 
and rolls. Just let her rip, Ken! Oh! 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 oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> like, just ride with it for the next one. Yeah. yeah. Honestly, that one, the, you the could have rode with it. wouldn't have hurt yeah. that bad. One more time. One more time. Normally, when you say one more time, then that's when something bad happens, but we're kind of aiming for something bad to happen right here. Hopefully, our bad luck works in good luck. Take three. Right there. Oh, oh my gosh! Holy crap! Crack that windshield. I was about this close to saying I'll ride with this time. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I mean, dude, dude, you'd be totally fine. The, the, the Honestly, frame is perfect. Come on, Ken, put your back into oh, it. Crap, I was so oh, shit. Whoa, that wheel. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. That's what happens when you buy a replica wheel. I've been on it a day now. I got money on my mind. Now they better pay me. Bet they want to see me way down. We got special delivery. Oh, the dozer. We're back at it again with the dozer. Hi, Ben. How are you? Good. How are you guys doing? Oh, shit. We're always good. Hi. Howdy. Uh, you guys behaving so much? Not really. This is good. <laughs> Man, Richard, what a beauty. God, what a guy. I wish he had an Instagram. Otherwise, I mean, I'd bug him for sure. But. Dude, he's just a good old corn runt classic right there. Yeah. All right, so we got the dozer back. We're doing a little bit of track maintenance before fall kicks in. We've been riding a lot more pit bikes lately, and our track was just not set up for pit bikes. It was a lot more of a quad track. So we got Cody in the dozer. He's going to fix it up. No idea what he's going to do. He just said he's going to make a lot of jumps right here. We'll see. <laughs> I just got done editing Monday's video and I haven't seen the track yet. Holy I told you you were gonna be surprised. Dude, there's literally no grass left. Dude. What? Look at that. I'm like a little kid right now, dude. <laughs> no! What the f is this? Dude, this is legit insane. Ryan said I could dig to the moon and then I kind of went wild. Well, you can't dig to the moon. Dig to the. You can dig, dig to Mars. The moon. I said dig to Mars. Oh which shit! Mine was way better. Mine was way better. <laughs> yeah, equally, it's insane. Oh my god, we're gonna need to buy a skid steer just to maintain this thing. No, I don't. I'm gonna pack it hopefully so hard tomorrow that we don't have to mess with it for a bit. Yeah. So this dirt is not. It's literally not dirt. It's clay. So once it's packed. It pretty much packs like cement and holds its own. It is a lot of just like big obstacles right now, but tomorrow I'll be able to fill it in with a skid. Like just little doubles and stuff like that. Okay, so it's getting to the end of the day with the uh, skid steer and it's looking like incredible. Cody's basically dragging everything and, and just flattening everything down. So he's gonna go till dark. We've been kind of sessioning things here and there. CJ and Ben are probably gonna hit it right now. And then tomorrow we'll come out, all rip it at the same time and showcase the new track, which is like 18,000 times cooler than the last track. Everything is like second gear half. Hands. You still don't make it sometimes. Been riding, rolling, drinking, smoking. That's something I do. I've been hiding all of my emotions. That's something I do. I've been rolling around. I've been rolling around. That's something I do. I've been rolling around. I've been rolling around. That's something I do. I've been riding, rolling, drinking, smoking. Holy! That's that was a boot. Yeah, like, okay, so you know you gotta hit everything second chin but like, is you gotta feel comfortable. Did you hit that second pin? Hit second pin. Oh, he got I've sketchy there. Yeah. How is he not bone or air in it? Dude, I don't know. He's looking good on it. Holy! Dude, I don't know. I, are you doing it just because the camera's on? Because, wow! Dude. I mean, when you're sending it like that, dude, you're landing halfway down the face. Oh shit! Are you okay? You okay? What happened? I think I broke my foot. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm 
almost definitely broke my foot. Can you move it? You can move your toes. That's a good sign. Whatever it is, looks painful. I'm just coming through the pine trees. As I see him go up, nose way in the air. I'm like, that is not going to end well. Is it broken, you think? Or? I mean, it's super swollen instantly, which is, you know, as bad. But so what happened? Did your boner air and, did then, boner air and then your feet slip off? Or I don't really know what happened, dude. Just did it the, the inside? Might. Launched weird and no, it just yeah, landed weird. Awesome. Just kind of you know. tipped over, flipped over. Mm -hmm. Dude, Cody, you're, <laughs> the booter's too see, big, bro. I didn't mean to. Shit. So, uh, yeah, CJ's definitely injured, unfortunate. Honestly, I do have to say I'm happy it wasn't me for once. <laughs> like, for real. Um, but we're going to go check on him in a little bit. Cody's going to, I guess, keep finishing the track. You got to keep those vibes high. What's up, ladies and gents? It is the next day. Cody just finished the track. Uh, ben took a little hit at it last night in the skid steer as well. It looks incredible. It looks mind-blowing. Here's a drone shot. Let's go check it out. All right, Cody made pretty quick work of this. Very Ken smart car, so it's always going to be a part of the track. We're trying to make it so you can still get into it. And it's kind of just a tribute for the awesomeness of that smart car. Amazing. Was it sick? Uh, no. This is a crazy, I don't know, quarter pipe practically, transfer. It might need some lip work, but it's pretty epic. And there's also a spine on the other side as well. This is a new one that's it's honestly pretty fun. You hop up and come right down into a berm on the other side. So you kind of got to whip right into that. into the open area over a nice roller here it leads us into one of the most fun berm sections of the entire track after the finish line jump you're coming around this berm and you're coming up a little hump here into a bigger face on the same tabletop. This one's kind of tough to clear on the pit bike, so we'll see how Cody does. So this right here was the big gap before, and now it's just a big tabletop, probably the biggest one on the track. Ben was sending it last night, as you guys saw. CJ was hot on his tail trying to clear it like him. And we still don't know yet. We still don't know the results, but like might have broken his foot. Either way, it's pretty messed up. He's on crutches. So we're on the fence about it. I mean, it's a gnarly one for the pit bikes, but we'll learn it. Whether you clear it or not, you're going to come down this, over this fun hump, around the berm, into the two revamped, now tabletop. Cody just kind of got him down. Those look perfect, dude. So after landing the second tabletop, you come off this berm over into this little rollover into arguably the most fun part of the track. Just straight up two BMX jumps, nice and steep. Honestly, one of the easier jumps to hit too. That looks like it hurt a little bit. So you're coming off the two BMX jumps here do a nice, basically U-turn of a berm right up over probably the biggest hump in the whole track. You're coming down over the speed hump right here. That's what I called it first. Anyway, into kind of like a little bit of a transfer jump, but it's a pretty easy jump to hit regardless of how massive the face is. You basically just go over and disappear. Coming off the transfer right here into a big, fat, wide berm. And then you drop back down like another little roller. And that's it. We got back to the smart car jump from where we started. Cody's going to hit it one more time. He said it sketches him out every time. I'm like, well, that's because there's a car underneath you instead of just dirt. We're going to have Ben come out and rip the track with Cody and I. We'll throw some GoPros on, show you what it do, baby. Next video, we'll have a real edit and we'll have the track dialed in. It only takes a couple days to really get the feel for it, but Cody just finished it last night, so we're excited.
to go second wide into this one. for this video but well, we're gonna come back next week with a full track session and hopefully by that point we actually know how to ride this big shout out to Cody for dozing and making this track for us pretty much Ken for letting us destroy his smart car also CJ hope his foot's okay if you guys enjoyed the video please do subscribe that's all we ask from you don't forget about the quad giveaway ending soon also we're gonna be building it next week if you guys saw on Instagram we have all those parts new parts for it so uh, don't want to miss that we also have a new drop coming October 15th so don't want to miss that either I've Stay tuned for next week. Day now. I got money on my mind. Now they better pay me. Bet they want to see me way down. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs>